the weather's extremely hot like it is right now, finding ways to wear makeup and still look good can really be a challenge. Professional makeup artist Federica Crutcher is here with some tips to help you look your best in the heat of summer. That's something we're all struggling with right now, isn't oh, it? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it is hard. Introduce us to your beautiful model here. Uh, this is my model, Shanita. Mm -hmm. um, I already have her makeup on just to show you the light look for the summer. Um, so the first thing you want to do is make sure your skin is prepped properly. Okay. You still want to put on your sunscreen mm -hmm. and then you're going to prime your face. So whatever primer you want to go with, make sure it's a mattifying primer. Um, and it keeps the oils and stuff down from your skin or whatever. So for people who've never used a primer before, what's the purpose? Well, the purpose is to, it sets your makeup okay. into place. All right. And it keeps your oils, you know, at yeah. bay. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> or sweat or whatever. Okay. Um, and so finishes it nicely. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay. And another thing I done on her, instead of foundations, because foundation can be kind of heavy during the summer, mm -hmm. I just did a... Um, a moisturizer, a tinted moisturizer on her. Okay. Mm -hmm. So if you don't have problems you're trying to cover up, uh, that can give you kind of a nice look yeah. without being super heavy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tinted moisturizer, and if you do have problems like acne scarring or something like that, you can just go with a concealer. Okay. Just do a spot treatment with a concealer and then do the tinted moisturizer. Okay, mm -hmm. good. So once you have the moisturizer on, you've got that nice tint going on, what do mm -hmm. you do next? You're going to do, you're going to go with a a powder. Okay. You're gonna go with a translucent powder, and this is how it looks. And that so translucent means it's gonna work for any skin yeah, tone, any right? Any skin tone. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's basically clear. Just give it a matte finish. Yeah. Or whatever. So you're just gonna go very lightly. And you're really knocking a lot of that off yes, the brush before just you go to the skin. Very lightly. Mm -hmm. And you just do that all, all over the over. face. Mm -hmm. All over the face. Very lightly, because you don't want that white film on your face. No. You just want no. it very lightly. Um, and then after that, you can go with your blush or whatever you want to do. Mm -hmm. Just make sure it's nothing too shiny yeah. during the summer because you're already going to sweat or whatever. Right. So do that. If you were going to wear a bronzer in the summer, and a lot of uh, folks with lighter skin tones do, mm -hmm. where would you put the bronzer? Well, bronzer, you, you mainly want to put it where the light hits, mm -hmm. mainly on your cheekbones, the tip of your nose, something like that. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't want to put it all over to make your whole face look you know, just like clown like. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> all right. So yeah, you're gonna do that. And also make sure you go with um, waterproof. Anything okay. waterproof. For your eyes like, especially. Uh -huh, the brow pencil, waterproof. Mm -hmm and uh, your mascara waterproof. Okay. And so what I've done with the waterproof mascara, a really good tip is to spritz the brush with a setting spray. Okay, mm -hmm. that's great. And then you use setting spray all over yes. the face once mm -hmm. you've completed yes. your makeup. After the translucent powder and your blush, whatever you want to do, you're going to spritz your face with the setting spray. All right, let me take that from you and show us your other trick. I don't know if anybody uses these blotting tissues. All right, but, uh, <laughs> yes. So if you're out in the heat, sweating, or whatever, these blotting papers, and you're just going to blot. This is a mattifying blotting paper. Okay. You're just going to blot, and it just keeps your makeup in place and just removes the sweat. And that's good for people who have oily skin, oh, too. Yeah. It oh, yeah, it removes the oil the oils, out. too. So mm -hmm. you can use that year-round. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. That's a great look. Anything we ought to do um, makeup-wise to kind of change it up for the summer? You know, like lip color, eye color, yeah. things like that? Um, her eye color, I don't, just something neutral, you know. Or you can go with something kind of light, but more on a neutral side. Mm -hmm. um, and the lip color, more of like a gloss. Okay. I did like a glossy finish to her with like a little pink nude. Mm -hmm. Nice and fresh. Yeah. You look great. Thank you so much. <laughs> Appreciate you being with us. Thank good you. tips for keeping cool <laughs> and looking cool, too. You'll find Federica's contact information on our website if you'd like to get in touch with her.